for a lot of people, artworks where other things have failed. And for those guys, um, I think it's really crucial that they have the opportunity to make art and, um, and that we see the benefits every single week when we go and see them. Their behaviours improve, um, officers say they're much calmer, there's less violence and agitation in the wings where art is embedded and made regularly by the inmates. A huge proportion of the jail population have mental health issues. We've got inmates here who um, have had acute um, anxiety and depression and the medication wasn't working for them, but they found if they could make a painting a day, that would um, it benefit them um, hugely. The jail environment is really um, extremely different to the environment outside the jail. It's very oppressive, um, it's very limited in what you can do, and um, it can be very tense and occasionally violent. So for the guys to practice art inside is a chance to focus, to relax, and to um, maybe escape for a while from their immediate surroundings. For many people, making art is a really um, vitally important thing to their, their survival, their mental health. It gives them a really unique opportunity in um, reflecting upon where they are, who they are, how they got there, and where they might like to go in future. We usually get an email or a telephone call from someone in the jail um, letting us know an inmate has some work that he wants collected and we'll bring it to the jail um, and put it on display. And if it sells, 85% of the sale price goes back to the artist. From that money they'll either buy their next canvas to work on um, and they usually send money out to their family, which for them is a huge boost to their self-esteem. Um, for a lot of them it's the first honest money they've earned for years and the fact that they can accumulate money and send it back to their, their partner and their kids it's, um, it gives them some power back into their lives which they didn't have before. For me as an artist, to find someone who's so motivated that they will get over all the obstacles put in their way to still set up an art studio, have an art practice um, in spite of everything, I find that as an artist really inspiring.